So how did you get involved with the project in the first place? It was a lack of kind of a, um, employment opportunities. No, um, what, what happened was... <laughs> <laughs> you sure? Yeah. Um, <laughs> no, I was doing all right. Sorry. Uh, no, no, yeah, yeah. Um, actually, my wife got cast in this about a month before it. And so I was privy to the screenplay before I even knew I was going to audition for it. Nice. And I was kind of unbelievably jealous <laughs> that she would get to do it. it you know, it's... it's as a script, it was just kind of like sort of pretty mind blowing, and you know, kind of. So I can only imagine what we're going to see. Um, so when I got called for the audition, you know, I was kind of prepped. I knew, you know, I was like, you know, I was so excited. I was so excited. To do that. Um, yeah. So I mean, I, and obviously being a fan of Amy and Amy's work and Ben's work beforehand, and knowing the, you know the cast that was already involved at that point is just like it's kind of a sort of dream come true. It's yeah. sort of unbelievable. I mean. How do you assemble that kind of cast on, on something with this budget? And it's, it's a, you know, it's a, it's a testament to Ben and Amy, it's a testament to, to Jeremy, Jeremy Thomas, the producer. Uh, so, you know, on most jobs you, you kind of you get the call from your agent and you're like, oh, God, I don't have, I don't have, I don't have expect that, I can't, I can't believe it. And this one I was like, no, no, no. <laughs> completely speechless for you know, a couple of hours. You know, it's kind of a, an amazing thing and, yeah, and I mean, I, I, stepping I onto set right from the off is just think clear about this is going to be a very, very, very different filming experience. And and people, and it's, people, and <laughs> Maybe it's amazing because he's got such an eye for the kind of the whole thing. Um, it's a whole cinematic kind of eye for the, the, all the process and the edits as he goes along. And yet it's so free. It's so unbelievably kind of free. And I'm not a kind of big improviser generally, but yeah. everyone was just, I don't know, there was just this energy that, that made us all want to do that. And it seems sort of, it was this beautiful chaos, you know, it, within kind of this boundary of, of kind of safety because you just trust everyone. Around his, um, he's doing it, you know, so it, it, it was, uh, yeah, I mean, a really, one of a kind of experience. So you wrote it so it's been Yeah, I think, yeah, and that's what I thought, you know, you're on the page, like, no, you know, you get the audition size, but I don't like, oh, get that, you don't get that, and hey, he's kind of quite posh, and it was like really obvious, and kind of, no, maybe he's not, no, he really is, and then you kind of, <laughs> And um, but fantastic, you know. You kind of. I was really proud that they were even considering it for it, and I think and it, was, it was funny, you know. I think what attracted me to, to that role and the, the, the sort of where was this kind of this humour, you know, humour with you know, as it was in all of Ben stuff, and it was kind of really obvious that there was that kind of um, opportunity with with, with Talbot, with Adrian Talbot, to play. Um, so that kind of stopped me thinking, you know, I just yeah, concentrate on that rather than going, I'll never get it, I'll never get it. I've got someone who's in. Yeah, and that would have just, yeah, I don't know. I mean, I'll say I'm not shit, you know. <laughs> Alright, <laughs> um, but you know, it's that thing. It's also when you, I thought it was a departure, but you get on set and you, you know straight away you can trust the directors, and you, you stop worrying. And you just stop worrying, and it's not. They see you as that person, and you can do it. And I, I was fortunate to did um, Ben's next film with the Free Fire as well. It was a completely different thing.